Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Mark, Lee, oh, nice. why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is Again, a sometimes help out the, the dead get tangled fence. up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All she the would, more reason but... for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs some exactly. help securing the perimeter, then my that's what we do. St. John's. Alright, let's do some walking. Look at the swing. I might be able to fix this swing for the kids. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. By fixing a swing and not the rope. By fixing the swing and not the fence, that's what I meant. <laughs> Let's walk around. I'll do that last. You can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. So what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? Getting the perimeter secured is gonna help us a lot. Mm -hmm. We'll be getting in good and making this place safer for us. I'm gonna get back to it. Well, look at this picket fence. All Tom Sawyer-like. Mm. Wee. Mmm, <laughs> horny. This is too big right now, but if I can find something to cut it down to size, this might make a good seat for the swing. Hmm. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Go, Go right ahead. ahead. Yeah. I'll put that in my back pocket. Man, this fence is fantastic. We'll do whatever you want to help keep it running. Well, clearing that perimeter is going to be a big help. Just let me know when you're ready. Well, let me go fix the swing and then go take a look at the gate. Maybe go up the house and say hi. It's good, but I need some rope. Are you serious? <sighs> Let's go find some rope. Maybe you can find stuff up the up at the the house. Fresh herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. Mmm. Fresh herbs. Maybe we can find some in the chest right here. In the shoe bucket. Rope. There you go. This rope is perfect for the swing. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? This place was my daddy's life. Meant mm. everything to him. You know, when he first bought this place, it was a single-story house. Is that right? 
After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. Said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. <laughs> Mama, she was done after damn. <laughs> My folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left of Daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourselves. That's nice of him. That's right, now walk away. Walk away. Knock, knock. Hey, Paula. Hey, hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. How many rooms does this house have? Rooms? Why do you ask? It looks custom, custom built. built. Nice of you to notice. My husband put a lot of work into this old house. Well, he did a fantastic job. I believe in making a house a home. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, I think I'll leave let now. me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. Time to walk away. Walk away. Oh, that was me. Let's go fix this damn this damn swing. Now walk it out. Now walk it out. All right. This shouldn't be too tough. Well, I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. Dinner's Did ready. you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. <laughs> All fixed. That should make everyone happy. Sitting it. Sitting it. Oh. Well, it looks like I'm going to take a look at the perimeter now. Man, I love what they did with the background. I don't know why. Pointy. I'm going to talk to Andy. Hi. Hi. Well, hey. I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Gotta start to weasel our way in here. Let's see, we are we the first. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but. Ultimately, they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Through Facebook and other stuff like that. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These That's generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Yeah. Like us. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Oh, I hope it's just... I hope that Mark guy doesn't die now. I have a feeling he's probably going to be killed by a band or get shot or die. Something like that. Walking, walking, Do you think we're walking. doing enough to get the St. John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over-anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is going to go a long way. 
I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. He wouldn't be such a pain in the <laughs> ass if you weren't no telling him Larry. we were talking behind his back all the time. I, I'm, I'm sorry, all right? I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. There's one. There's an arrow too. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Just making Come sure. On, let's push it off. First, I want to pull the arrow out. Disgusting. Andy said, when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. <laughs> oh, it better be. Who do you think he was? Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. Well, let's take care of him. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, Somewhat. Can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas. Easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Nice group of guys. These folks are just delaying the inevitable. This place is gonna fall apart. Just like everywhere oh, shit. else. That's right, I'm doubting him. <laughs> Maybe you're right. There's another one. I see it. Oh, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. Let go. Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. Chop it. <laughs> Bibbity bubbity boot. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Nope. Probably should have fixed that post. Can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Just try to focus on the task. They knew what they were doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. <laughs> uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Being conditioned. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Little help here, Lee? If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. <laughs> well, help, fine. I just don't want to be on the other side of the fence. Holy oh. fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Whoa! 